Hi everyone, so today's video is going to be about booty, so it's something a little bit different for my channel but I needed the biggest sort of motivation for a health kick. I am so unhealthy, it's untrue, I have no motivation to stop eating crap, no motivation to do any exercise, so this is probably just exactly what I need at the minute because I am so unhappy with my whole body and appearance and my skin, so I just need a good cleanse my body needs a good cleanse so i'm sure you will have all heard of booty before it's all over instagram i'm sure it's sold in holland and barra and it's quite big now and i think the most known for their booty 28 day t-tox i know a few people that have done this a few people um that have had it and trialed it and you know but i wanted to give it a go now this is going to discuss uh discuss discussed a lot of Yorkshire people. Me being Yorkshire, I have never had a cup of tea. Obviously we have the Yorkshire tea brand. I've never tried a cup of tea and this is just gonna send shockwaves everywhere. But yeah, by all means, I know the booty tea tox tea is not gonna be the same as a Yorkshire cup of tea where you milk and your sugar and that. But yeah, this is gonna be my first cup of tea that I try. So I've not had one of the T-Tox teas yet, but inside you do get two bags. So you get 28 days worth of daytime tea. I'm just like dropping this over and smacking myself in the face. 28 day daytime tea bags. And then you also get 14 bedtime tea bags as well. So you get the nighttime and daytime set, which is really good because I know a lot of people will wake up and have a cup of tea or have a cup of tea before they go to bed to help them get to sleep. It has all natural ingredients in the tea bags and it's going to be the best way to give you a good detox and give your body a good clean. And also with us, I have the booty little travel mug thing. So you can pop your green tea in here and take it with you. So if you're going to work on a morning, you don't have time to drink, like I rush like anything in the morning just to get an extra few minutes in bed, then I would be taking this to work with me and having my tea on the go. So. That's a really good idea to bring this out with the tea tox as well. I then have the booty shake which is a massive tub of protein shake. You can probably tell it's massive because it's like the size of my head. So I got the flavour banana. You can get vanilla, banana or chocolate. I went for banana because I've had vanilla with protein shakes. Um, I have never had banana and chocolate I don't like chocolate fi flavoured fi things. If I'm having chocolate, it has to be chocolate or like a chocolate dessert. I don't like chocolate ice cream and chocolate milk and that sort of thing. So that's why I didn't opt for that one. So yeah, this has 900 grams of protein in. Now I do need some tips with protein. If you could all let me know if you do use a protein shake, what do you put in with your protein? Because I've tried water and that is absolutely just disgusting. And obviously milk's quite fattening. So what do you all recommend I put in with my protein? Because I'm not big on this sort of stuff. I don't really know what I'm doing. I just need a whole new kickstart to my health because I'm just crap at being healthy. But with that, I have the Booty Protein Shaker, which currently has water in because I've been using it as my water cup really i know how much water i'm getting per day if i just keep topping this cup up because i know how big the cup is i know how much water i'm having if that makes sense i sound like i'm just talking a load of crap here though again i've obviously got a very deprived childhood because porridge is something that i have never eaten it just never sort of appealed to me so today i have my first bowl of porridge and it was the little oats in here you get 560 60 grams which is 14 servings it is a massive pack of porridge to be fair um per scoop it is 148 calories and you just add water to this and not milk because it's already quite creamy i did put a little bit of jam into my porridge because i wasn't 100 percent on just having porridge on its own with me never having it before i wanted to give it a go with something else in there and it wasn't bad i don't I think the consistency is my favourite. It's kind of quite sloppy and oaty at the same time. I, I think that's just me being really picky and weird. Um, but the actual taste was really nice. So I think we're going to take these to the new house once we move because Sam likes porridge and obviously that's one less thing for us to buy then and we've just got it in the cupboard. Um, so yeah, we've got 
porridge, little oats. Also something we'll be taking to the new house is the Booty Coconut Oil. Now I love coconut oil, I use it to take my makeup off and I just think it is the best cleanser ever. It removes all your makeup and leaves your skin feeling amazing. Obviously it's got the other benefits of using it as a hair conditioner but cooking with it is meant to be really really healthy. So obviously we haven't sort of bought food and oil and stuff for the house yet so I thought this would be really good. We could take this and we've got the oil that we need you know when we move in and it's a healthy oil as well. It's not a really fattening oil is 100% organic virgin coconut oil and it's a massive tub as well this is 500 ml which is 460 grams so yeah I'm gonna be using this when we're cooking in this new house I've got six bags of the booty popcorn I obviously don't need to show you all six but uh, they came in a box and it has six bags in they have three different flavors they have sour cream and black pepper lightly salted and the ones that I have are sweet and salty popcorn and it does say up here that it has matcha tea in there which I will talk a little bit more about soon each bag has 150 calories which I think is really good because I'm one of these people that will go eat something if I'm bored so I'll just like go grab a packet of crisps if I'm bored but now I can grab the popcorn instead which is obviously a much healthier option the porridge oats also has the matcha tea in as well and speaking of matcha tea, I have a little tub of my own. So I've never actually heard of this before, but it says 100% Japanese matcha green tea powder. Um, so you can add this to shakes, like your protein shakes, you can add it to smoothies, or you can have it on its own as a cup of green tea. And when I opened it, I was shocked at how green this was. I don't know if you'll be able to see on camera. Oh yes, it's picking up brilliant. But how green is this green tea going to be? I've never tried it, I don't know much about it because I've never heard anything about it. Um, so yeah, I'll see how I get on with that. But I've heard it's quite expensive, is matcha tea. So yeah, I'm hoping I'm going to like it because it sounds very healthy. I have two little tubs of vitamins. So I've got the Booty Multivits, which I have started already. I'm the biggest wimp when it comes to swallowing tablets and vitamins and things and I'm like panicking that it's going to get stuck in my throat. So these are quite big tablets and I was like, oh my god, it's just going to get stuck and I'm going to die and choke. And But it was alright, I swallowed it and I got there. But they're really good for a daily vitamin kick, is what it says. They are also food supplements and you get 60, ca 60 capsules in this one. And then these ones are called CLA. Now I don't know if they're called CLAT or CLA, but I'm going to go with CLA because it sounds a little bit better. And this one says little capsules of natural essential acids. Again, it says food supplements and you get 90 capsules in this one rather than your 60 capsules. And these look really scary and big, so I'm scared to take these. <laughs> and the last thing in the range that I have is the Booty Brownies. So these are brownies with low sugar and high protein. So you get your box of 12 brownies and it says on the sides how to cook them if you want to have them cooked. Um, a little bit of information about them and their new ingredients and what's in them. So in each brownie there is 250 calories. They're each individually wrapped up in these wrappers. And I'm actually really impressed with these. I've had a couple already and I had one cold because I didn't even realise that you could warm them up. And then when I saw the little note on the back saying ready to eat or heat up for chocolatey gooiness, I was like oh my god I need to put it in the microwave. So put it in the microwave for 20 seconds and it's all gooey and warm, it looks like a chocolate fudge cake and it still tastes like a brownie which is the best thing about it. Sometimes I think you can buy stuff and it just doesn't taste like, like a cookie or a brownie or a biscuit and they're meant to be all full of high protein and they just don't taste like it. But these brownies do taste like brownies, they're amazing and I'm 100% it's going to have the a fraction of calories as opposed to a normal brownie does. So it has added green tea in as well, just like most of the rest of the items from Booty. If you're on like a bit of a detox or a diet, I would 1 million percent recommend the Booty brownies as a little sweet snack or if you can't have your chocolate, this is just gonna, you know, completely get rid of your cravings for your chocolate and have this instead. Amazing. I'm so impressed. So that is everything that I have got from Booty. Please let me know in the comment section if you have tried any of the products that I have shown or any of the other products that are on the website. 
I think I do have the majority of the products but there is a few other ones as well so I'd definitely like to know how you have all got on with it and what you thought to it. Hopefully this is going to give me the kickstart that I need to a healthy new live because that would be brilliant. So please give this video a thumbs up if you, if you enjoyed it. I will leave my Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook all in down by if you do want to follow any of those. Please remember to subscribe. I cannot get my words out today if you haven't already. And I will see you all in my next video, everyone. Bye!